Welcome back, everybody, to a new map, kind of, sort of. Your host, with not the most, Mr. Blue, a.k.a. Tommy Miller. Folks, does this bring back memories of what? This is Goldcrest Valley V2 for Farming Simulator 19. That's right, folks. We're back on Goldcrest Valley. For some of y'all that don't know, uh, I've done a, a series, Let's Play series on this. So go check out the Goldcrest Valley uh, FS17, which everything is pretty much the same. The train is the same, but the buildings, like the silo, the silo is not there. We get to put whatever we want in. Um, and it was a little shed barn like that over there that was there. And yeah, just some of the barns and stuff is gone. I did uh, start on from scratch. So yeah, um, do y'all want to see this map? We're going to see all of it pretty much. Just take y'all up as far as it can go on my drone here. There's the Goldcrest Valley, the town. Of course, we got all the fields. Remember field five? That's it right over. It don't look that big from here, but yeah. And it's, it's just a 2X map. Nothing special. We're going to do a, a start from scratch, is I guess what I'm going to call it. I really don't know. Uh, it's just it's gonna be totally different than the way I play. I've been trying to think outside the box, as Mr. Yankee says from Yankees Outdoor Adventure. I, I just you know we're gonna think outside the box. So I'm starting like old stuff and working the way up. Uh, make our money. Pop that screen on right here. I have thirteen thousand three hundred forty-seven. I started with five hundred thousand dollars. And I'm down to that. Oh, whoa. My speed's a little fast. We do have this truck here with the winch on the front, the motors, and we've got the trailer. It's a Ford 460 CID 385 V8. And this sucker is powerful. Listen to that sound. Y'all hear that? Oh, I just love those tires. I bet Boo Boo Jr. Um, Zach and Betsy likes it too. Let's go mudding. And probably Colin Jr. would like it too. Y'all like mudders? Put it down below in the comments, folks. All right, I got a small problem, folks. Going to use trees to make our money. And as you can see here, I've been starting it in four meter whips. Oh, okay, I should have. And yeah, you probably hear me sniffling. I got the cold a little bit, sinuses. So sorry to all y'all with that. But I've been cutting down these trees here, and only way I got to wait to see, I can I can lift these small ones. Am I on the ground? Oh no, I'm not. Okay, that maybe I need F1. I don't have my hand. So I can pick up these. Those won't be no problem. No problem at all. I can load them in. I guess I might have to cut them in chunks. But I really don't want to do that. Not the only way I get to pick them up. Does this hope four meter fits in here? I don't know if I can put a winch up here or not. On some trailers you can, and some trailers you can't. But I do have a winch in the truck, but I won't have no way of pulling them up. And watch this, folks. 17 with this trailer, we had to dump the trailer in order to drive stuff up in there. Now we got ramps. That's awesome. So, uh, to go in our screen here, I bought, let's go to lands. Um, 
Yeah, I bought 16 and 15 and 14. And I didn't really want all this here, but to do the stuff I'm wanting to do with this Let's Play, the role play, I had to go ahead and buy the outskirt boundaries, which was 4.4 .4 million. So I did cheat that money in just for that outcome. Let me zoom out here so you can see a little bit better. But I only bought this, this, and this field here. And the rest of this was, you know, we're going to say it's not ours, but it, it really is. But, you know, it's the only way we get to use some of this stuff. Now, the BGA is on its own. So, yeah. Can't buy that. But anyway, our fields here, we don't have nothing in them. Let me turn grass on. And uh, as you can see, these three has been harvested, not by me. And uh, this one will need plowed and, and limed. Okay. So no biggie there. We're going to be taking contracts. Um... But we're going to be using their equipment. We, we don't have no equipment right now. So, yeah. That's uh, that situation. You know, I think I'll... Yeah, I better close this back. Put the ones I can in there. Go from there. I'm wanting to take out a loan. So we buy some equipment, but... Yeah, it, it's, it's this, I don't know, I ain't been all over the place, I ain't been in the barn, I haven't been out in the woods to take a look or anything like that, so, to show you the house here, got the garage down here, which you can't get in it, doors are sealed, and got the windmill here, which I don't think it does anything, it's decorations, Probably going to put a uh, workshop trigger here so we can take care of our equipment when we get going. Is the mailbox back up? Yes, yeah, the mailbox back up. I uh, accidentally hit that mailbox uh, uh, when I was coming in. Uh, the thing about we own this here, that'd be a good grass field if we get all the trees cut down and get that leveled. Maybe replant grass. On FS 17, there was some. Um, chicken uh, chicken pen right here but there isn't one now but I was thinking we could, could, could put a small one in something that holds like 50 chickens that'll help out ow ow branches well I got this little shack up here ooh pitchfork now, I could put like a free range chicken thing here and fence it off I don't know how hard that would be Let's go take a look at this old barn. It looks pretty well taken care of. Don't know about the inside though. Wait, what? What do we have here, folks? We have a International Turbo 4166. Oh, wow. Finders keepers, right? I gotta talk to my lawyer. This I don't know if this comes with it or not. Hmm. Yeah, International 4166. Let's take a look on the inside. Oh, it's out of fuel for one. Yeah, bad looking tractor. We could use this, folks. We could use this. Gotta get some fuel for this thing. Where would I go buy some? Hmm. I need uh need to take my truck up and buy some fuel. I I'm curious. I tell you what, folks, I'm gonna load up some logs that I can. Uh, with the ramp. Maybe I can find a way to get them in there. I'm going to go to town. Take this trailer with me. See if I can. Uh, I'm going to take it over to the sawmill. 
drop these logs off, see how much I can get for them. And then I'm going to talk to my lawyer about that tractor before I even touch anything. I'm on now. I don't know why my hand ain't showing up. Hmm. I can't even pick up nothing. There we go. Oh, that's a little heavy. At least I can pick that one up. Hmm. But yeah, I'm gonna talk to the lawyer and uh see who's tractor. If it's ours, I'm gonna buy some fuel for it, get it running. Maybe I can get some kind of thing for it. And we'll go from there, folks. But that's about all I can do on this episode. I'm gonna try to keep them a little bit short. Just a little bit. You know, it might be a few long ones in, in here and there. Yeah. Well, I'm going to throw these that's kind of light so I don't have to make so many trips. But I appreciate y'all coming out and watching. I really don't know what I'm going to call this series, but uh, yeah, we'll find out in the title. So thanks for coming by. I love each and every one of y'all. Folks, y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and uh, I'll see y'all in the next episode. Later.